Siamese cat versus Manx cat. What are the differences between these two cat breeds? The appearance of the Siamese is determined by the breed standard of each organization. The Siamese is expected to have a slender yet muscular physique with long lines, according to most cat organizations. The wedge-shaped head is long and tapering outward to the points of the ears, forming a triangle. The unusually large ears are wide at the base, pointed at the tip, giving them the same triangular shape as the head. Medium-sized almond-shaped eyes are always a deep vivid blue. The body is often described as tubular and is supported by long, slim legs, with the hind legs higher than the front legs. The Siamese walks on small, dainty, oval paws and swishes a long, thin tail that tapers to a fine point. The short coat of the Siamese has a fine texture. In the Cat Fanciers Association, it comes in four colors, seal point, a pale fawn to the cream body with deep seal brown points and deep brown nose leather and paw pads, chocolate point, an ivory body with milk chocolate colored points and cinnamon pink nose leather and paw pads, blue point, a bluish white body with deep blue points and slate colored nose leather and paw pads, and lilac point, a glacial white body with frosty pinky gray points and lavender pink nose leather and paw pads. The Manx is notable for not having a tail, however not all Manx are entirely tailless. Some have normal length tails, known as longies, while others, known as stumpies, have short tails. A Manx with no tail is referred to as a rumpy, whereas one with only a rise of bone at the end of the spine is referred to as a riser. In the show ring, only rumpies and risers are shown, although cats with tails can be utilized in Manx breeding operations. The Manx has two different coat lengths, a short double coat or a long-haired double coat. The long-haired Manx is called a Kimrick in some cat registries, but the Cat Fanciers Association simply considers the long hair a variety of Manx. In both lengths, the coat comes in many different colors, including various solids, tabbies, tortoise shells, and calicos. Chocolate and lavender colors and the pointed Himalayan pattern are not permitted. Hello! This video is sponsored by Bmix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. The most important thing to know about Siamese cats is they are talkative and opinionated. They will tell you exactly what they think, in a loud, raspy voice, and they expect you to pay attention and act on their advice. Siamese cats are extremely fond of their people. They like to be helpful and will follow you around and supervise your every move. When you are sitting down, a Siamese will be in your lap, and at night he will be in bed with you, probably under the covers with his head on the pillow. Do not get a Siamese if living with a chatty busybody would drive you insane. On the other hand, if you enjoy having someone to talk to throughout the day, the Siamese can be your best friend. Just be sure you have time to spend with this demanding and social cat. Siamese does not like being left alone for long periods, and if you work during the day it can be smart to get two of them so they can keep each other company. The Siamese is highly intelligent, agile, athletic, and loves to play. Keep his busy brain active with puzzle toys and his body exercise with teaser toys he can chase and a big cat tree he can climb. Never leave him without any form of entertainment, or you will likely come home to find that he has reprogrammed your DVR to record only nature shows or at the very least decided your toilet paper rolls and tissue boxes look better empty. Choose a Siamese cat if you look forward to spending time with and interacting with your cat. This is a loyal and loving feline who will pout and pine if given little or no attention. In the right home, however, he thrives for years. The Manx began life as a mouser, and he retains his fine hunting skills and alert nature. With a Manx around the house, you don't need a watchdog, you've got a watch cat who reacts rapidly and will growl threateningly or maybe even go on the attack at the sight or sound of anything out of the ordinary. If he sees that you aren't alarmed, he'll settle back down. When he's not protecting his family and property from mice, stray dogs, or other threats, however, the Manx is a mellow fellow, an even-tempered and affectionate cat who enjoys serene surroundings. That's not to say he is inactive. This is a happy, Playful cat who likes to follow his favorite person through the house and assist with whatever he or she is doing. When you are ready to relax, though, the Manx will be in your lap, ready for a comfy nap. If no lap is available, he'll curl up on the nearest available spot that allows him to keep an eye on you. He speaks in a quiet trill and will carry on a conversation if you talk to him. The Manx has an adaptable nature if he is exposed to activity and other people as a young kitten. He will enjoy meeting new people, greeting them with a gentle head butt or cheek rub, and can adapt to a new home or family if such an upheaval in his life is necessary. This is a smart cat who can learn tricks, including fetch and come, and is willing to walk on a leash if taught early. He often likes to ride in the car, making him a great companion on long-distance trips. 
It's not unusual for the Manx to enjoy playing in water, he is an island cat, after all, and you may find him turning on faucets or fishing at a fountain. He is also good at learning how to open doors, so be sure anything you don't want him to have is under lock and key. Unlike most cats, the Manx is willing to accept boundaries and will usually respect your wishes if you tell him no when he jumps on the counter or scratches on your sofa. Just be sure you give him an acceptable alternative as thanks for his nice behavior. The Manx is highly people-oriented. Choose him only if you can give him plenty of time and attention daily. The short, fine coat of the Siamese is easily cared for with weekly combing to remove dead hair and distribute skin oils. The soft, short coat of the Manx is easily cared for with weekly brushing or combing to remove dead hair and distribute skin oil. Check the rear end closely to make sure feces aren't clinging to the fur surrounding the anus, and clean it if necessary to prevent the cat from smearing poop on carpets or furniture. Brush the teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily dental hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Wipe the corners of the eyes with a soft, damp cloth to remove any discharge. Use a separate area of the cloth for each eye so you don't run the risk of spreading any infection. Check the ears weekly. If they look dirty, wipe them out with a cotton ball or soft damp cloth moistened with a 50 to 50 mixture of cider vinegar and warm water. Avoid using cotton swabs, which can damage the interior of the ear. Keep the litter box spotlessly clean. Like all cats, they are very particular about bathroom hygiene. It's a good idea to keep them as indoor-only cats to protect them from diseases spread by other cats, attacks by dogs or coyotes, and the other dangers that face cats who go outdoors, such as being hit by a car. Cats who go outdoors also run the risk of being stolen by someone who would like to have such a beautiful cat without paying for it. The active and social Siamese is a perfect choice for families with children and cat-friendly dogs. He will play fetch as well as any retriever, learns tricks easily, and loves the attention he receives from children who treat him politely and with respect. If he is introduced to them in kittenhood, the active and social Manx is a perfect choice for families with children and cat-friendly dogs. He will play fetch as well as any retriever, learns tricks easily, and loves the attention he receives from children who treat him politely and with respect. He lives peacefully with cats and dogs who respect his authority and can learn to leave birds and fish alone. An adult Manx may not appreciate children as readily, especially if he is used to a quiet household. Always introduce pets slowly and in controlled circumstances to ensure that they learn to get along together. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.